Welcome to a new US Master video tutorial. We want to show in this video how you can export from an UX5 HP a high precision project the GPS information to US Master. Uh, to show how to do this we will set up shortly a TBC project for a typical Trimble UX5 HP dataset. You will need following files for this setup. You will need a JXL file together with the .to4 file which contains the receiver raw data. Additionally to this you will also need the .to2 file which includes the reference station raw data. Please open Trimble Business Center. In this video tutorial we are working with Trimble Business Center version 3.62. We select from the start page start a new project and we choose as template the Trimble UX5 HP solution template. From the Project Explorer we right-click Unnamed and we select Project Settings. Project Settings we select Coordinate System and we hit the Change button. We choose Coordinate System and Zone and we select as a Coordinate System group the Worldwide UTM System. This demo data is in the 31 North Zone. We select the WGS 1984 horizontal datum and we do not have a GeoID model for this project data. Please assure whatever data you use that you use the correct coordinate system with the correct GeoID model. For me this is fine, I say OK. And I can now select the GXL file and drag and drop this GXL file into Trimble Business Center. The receiver raw data check-in window comes up. I hit OK. Then the compute project window comes up and I get an error with zero warnings. In my case I ignore this error and I hit yes and my import summary window comes up with the HTML file which I can close. In my plan view of Trimble Business Center I can see now my footprints and Trimble Business Center loads now for each single footprint it's associated image data. At this moment I do not have the um, receiver station data here. The receiver station is somewhere here on the bottom uh, center right of this project and I want to load now the receiver raw data. We can load the receiver raw data again by drag and drop the .to2 file into the plan view. We see the reference station mentioned and we hit OK. And we see now here in our project the reference station listed. We will use now from Trimble Business Center here the survey tab where we can calculate the baselines for our raw data that we just imported. After the baseline processing is finished Please save the result. We can now see the tra trajectories. When we zoom in we can see for each UX5 photo the position and we can also see the trajectories how they were flown in this project. We want now to export the GNSS positions and we will select therefore from the Project Explorer Flight Missions 
and select in our case this test flight block 3 by clicking on it. We see now a polygon highlighted showing this project area. When this is correctly selected, please hit the export button. Please do not hit this drop down uh, arrow below, but hit the upper part from the export button. You will see on the right side the export widget. We select from the export widget the survey tab. In the survey tab we select flight mission exporter. We can now select an export position file location and hit the export button to save our GNSS data from this UX5 high precision high precision project from Trimble Business Center. Let's take a look at the result. And here we have the Excel file or CSV file including our image name, then a unique ID, then a quality. One means that this is using the high precision RTK if the value 1 is here entered. Then we have the X, Y, Z position and we have aeronautical data which is pitch, yaw, sorry, roll, pitch and yaw. During the process in Trimble Business Center we have to be aware that the X, Y, Z position here is already reduced to the camera position so if you use in US Master the default UX5 high precision camera, please change the camera offset to 0, 0, 0 so that these values are um, with a high precision um, available for you and you can use them for processing. How to import this data into US Master and to take care for these things we will show in a different video. Until now, this is everything we wanted to show how to export from Trimble Business Center the data. Thank you very much for watching.